Shabbat Shalom, all nations. It is October the 19th, 2024. October is Breast Cancer and Domestic Violence Awareness Month. We still must live until God calls us home. So bringing awareness will help some people repent. My mother was killed through domestic violence. So in her memory, I bring awareness. Today, many women will awaken to beautiful flowers and candy, and many will awaken to name calling and fists, and some will not wake up at all. Any of us can be a victim of domestic violence, men and women. It can be physical, verbal, mental, financial, sexual, psychological, and I'm pretty sure there are many forms, and they all hurt. Some abusers will say, I didn't hit her, I just called her stupid, or bleep. Remember, words hurt too. Putting others down and bullying only highlights weaknesses in you. There are different ways to express love. Hitting someone to make them do or feel the way you do is not the answer. We must raise our voices for domestic violence victims. All people should be concerned because kids endure it too. Kids mock what they see. You may have been raised in an abusive home and you are projecting that behavior onto others. Before you can change anything, remember, you must first admit there is a problem. If you see someone crying, looking sad, and retreating after one of your actions, think back to how you felt. There is still time to repent and get help. Like Eve said, love is blind. So I wanted to make sure I included some scripture that personally helped me. 1 Corinthians 13, 4 through 6 says, Love is patient. Love is kind. It does not envy. It does not boast. It is not proud. It does not dishonor others. It is not self-seeking. It is not easily angered. It keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices with the truth. I just learned recently that one of my best friends died from breast cancer. I can't bring her back, but just maybe some lives would be saved through this podcast episode. Make sure that you check for lumps in your breasts and you get yearly screenings through mammograms. Early detection is the key. The National Breast Cancer Foundation says one in eight women or approximately 13% of the female population in the U.S. will develop breast cancer in their lifetime. On average, every two minutes, a woman is diagnosed with breast cancer in the U.S. Black women are 40% more likely to die from breast cancer than white women. The good news is there are currently over 4 million breast cancer survivors in the United States. As a woman, it makes me feel good that there is a lot of awareness for breast cancer. I even see NBA and NFL players wearing pink shoes and ribbons. I love that. Also keep in mind that domestic violence takes lives too. Keep wearing pink ribbons and also add in your purple ribbons to remind men and women that they are not alone. For more info on breast cancer, www.nationalbreastcancer.org. For more information about domestic violence, you can go to 1-800. The National Domestic Violence Hotline is 1-800-799-SAFE or the TTY number is 1-800-787-3224. Be safe in Yahshua.